Hello guys, I'm Dr. Manifyx and today I'm gonna play the Stanley Parable demo. So I hope that it is interesting. I played a Stanley Parable game but this is uh, obviously going to be a full-fledged release on Steam and uh, also you can download the demo here so yeah I can't wait It's already begun. I did not realize that. Okay, I'm I'm going there. Hmm. Welcome to the Stanley Parable demonstration. Your number you. is 28. When your number is displayed, please mm -hmm. enter the demonstration room. All Thank right. you and have a pleasant demonstration. Hmm. My number is twenty eight. Okay. It's taking too long. I could just enter. But I will wait my turn, even though there is no one else around. <laughs> Any minute now. Uh, I could sleep for an hour. Come on. Yes. Finally. <laughs> nice touch. That's that was cool. What? Oh, hello, hello, hello. Hey. Welcome to the Stanley Parable live demonstration. Can I sit in a chair? It will be my pleasure to guide you through this sneak peek at I what to expect in the Stanley so. Parable. A That's tease. Cool. Just enough to leave you hungry for more. How exciting. Can't you just feel that nervous tension? The looming yeah. uncertainty? Why don't we drink in the anticipation for a moment? Just for 20 minutes or so. Yes, yes. Please, for drink. just 20 minutes, don't move or act in any way. Simply remain motionless and let the thrill of demoing the Stanley Parable wash over you. What? Oh, I get it. You're too anxious. You can barely hold yes. still. Well, tell you what. I think we should walk off that nervous energy before getting the demo underway. Here, why don't I take you on a little tour of the facility and show you how we make a demonstration for a game like the Stanley Parable. <laughs> All right. This is where I and the other proctors have been working meticulously to construct a demo that explains clearly and concisely exactly what the Stanley Parable is, how it plays, and why you should spend real-world money on the main game. Video game demonstrations are tricky, and without the proper technology, you run the risk of the player having no idea what to expect in the full version. Ah, here is one such technology. These buttons are meant to convey the meaning of choice and the impact of the decisions you make. After all, choices carry tremendous meaning and consequence. Didn't you know that? Go ahead. Why don't you try picking one of these buttons to press and we'll see what your choice says about you. Huh. But there are so many. That's... How fascinating. Did you know that 94% of all people who select that particular button are sexual predators? <laughs> you see, our choices really do illuminate <laughs> the very intangible nature of our minds and souls. <laughs> Pervert. Obviously, I am a sexual predator. 
I'm I'm not okay. saying that I'm not. What else can I show you then? This place is the buffalo of game design. Nothing is wasted. Okay, let's see. What else do we have? Wall technology. Now I think you'll find this exciting. We've actually developed a wall that you can walk through. Go ahead. Give it a shot. You you are have to be kidding me. Oh. Hmm. Guess it's still in development. Right. Okay, <laughs> moving along. Oh my god. How's oh the anticipation? God. Still feeling it? Oh my god. This is probably... No. These jokes are really Now, cool. here's what we use to convey story. These booths convert text from a story into raw emotion. Go ahead. Step into one of them and feel the sheer power of narrative exposition. Okay, I'm gonna choose the spare. Where did these cliffs go? These crags that we stood upon, they shielded us from our own ignorance, spoke coddling words and wrapped our vulnerabilities in a woolen cloth that so many times I tried to set aflame. If I knew these comforts now, would their fibers be any more sensitive to the heat of my touch? Let's see discovery. It was though, and within, the shame he carried that ocean breeze did drift. The fierceness of the tides, the inevitable collapse of their sink. Courage. I wanna, I wanna see happiness. Oh, I guess not. This is the demo, after all. Oh, you went in both booths? Oh, yes. how vulnerable of you. If at any point during the demo you need to cry, just let me know and we can take a minute. Uh, let's see here. Compliments. One of the most important parts of administering any demonstration is pumping up your ego and appealing to insecurities about your sense of self-worth. Wow, That's of course. why we use this room to develop cheap compliments to shower on the player during the demo. Go ahead Ooh. and press that button to see some of the superficial flattery we've been cooking up. My heavens, I've never met someone who can consume as much uranium in a single sitting as you can. Just mm. look at you go. Of all the people I know who are playing this exact demo at this exact moment and standing in this exact room, your performance is easily in the top 5,000. Top 4,700 even. I won't go as far as 4,600. I wouldn't call that necessarily a compliment, but... Let's see. This device tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Somewhere around here there's also a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. <laughs> Are you that eager for the demo to start? Yes. Don't worry, we're almost there. Okay, I guess. Exit. Do. Ah, now this room is perhaps the most important you'll encounter in the demo. This is where we determine whether or not the demo has been effective. Whether it's conveyed the... No! What are you doing? You can't make that decision yet. You haven't played the demo. We've put so much work into this demonstration. <laughs> Wouldn't it be a shame if you rushed right into making a purchasing yeah. decision without savoring it first? Let this one simmer. You'll have plenty of time to decide later. Okay. I do not want to exit because I did not play the demo, but let's see. And there you have it. Everything you need to know about how video game demos are made. What's going on? However, it's still important that we address safety concerns. Please closely observe the following possible negative side effects of playing the Stanley Parable. If you agree to be held 100% responsible for any and all injury or long-term damage, mental, physical or otherwise, that may occur while playing the demo, please do not press the large red glowing disagree button at this time. Nothing? No objections? 
You're quite sure about that? Oh, well, I'm right sorry. Then. In the event that you do experience one or all but of the previously listed symptoms, no let's establish button. a signal for you to convey to me that you wish the demonstration to be terminated. Please step into the dance perimeter. Dance perimeter. Wait, I want to play the demo. Please step into... Okay. Please perform a dance. Your dance has been recorded. In the event that you feel confused or disoriented by anything you see inside the demo, perform that dance and I will terminate the demo immediately. Right. All preparations have been made. It is time at last. Are you prepared for the Stanley Parable? Yes. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. Let's do this. Let's do this right now. What? Oh wait, what? What are we doing Welcome here? Welcome to the Did Stanley not... Parable demonstration. Your number is oh. 29. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Okay, uh, I'm lost. Let's just get back to the green room and start the demo again. I must have done something wrong the first time. I believe that. Okay, here we go. The Stanley Parable Demo Take 2. Finding the demo, learning exactly what the Stanley Parable is. Here it comes. Yes. Yes. Oh, wait. What's this? It's a number. But... Do I want to press it? Hell yeah. Eight. Eight. Wait, 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 wait. It's This is all wrong. This isn't the Stanley Parable. This is a game where you press a button and it says eight. Not only is the Stanley Parable not a game about continuously pressing the number eight, I can guarantee that this button does not appear anywhere in the main game. Why is it here instead of the demo for the Stanley Parable? <coughs> Where did the demo go? There was an actual demo here before. Something has gone wrong. It's all gone horribly wrong. We need to get but you out of here before you start forming impressions of the Stanley Parable based on whatever the hell this egg game is. We need to get out. We need to start over. You mustn't stay here another minute. Out, out, out. Go, go, go. All right. Imagine if this had been the demo, what would you have been thinking? You'd have left with no idea what the Stanley Parable is about, none whatsoever. I guess I'm gonna head my way back. And... Welcome to the Stanley yes, yes, Parable yes, Demonstration. Time. Your number is 30. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. This was supposed to be the way to the demo room. Okay, now let's take a minute to get something straight here. When you sit down to play this demo, you are assuming an amount of responsibility for its outcome. Now, I can't say for certain whether you caused us to encounter the eight game rather than the Stanley Parable, but I think it's a pretty safe assumption that you had something to do with it. At this time, please take a minute to think about all of the mistakes you've made in playing this demonstration, as well as your lack of respect for demo taking in general. Mm. Mistakes. Hmm, I should have gone to a one boot. Wonderful. I could and really feel the introspection on my end. Now that we're that's all it. on the same page again, I feel ready to I attempt the demonstration once more. In this third attempt, we shall truly everything. come to understand the meaning of the Stanley Parable. You cannot do Let that because the demonstration demo. begin.
don't get me wrong, this is really amusing, but... What? can't be over yet. You didn't see anything. Everything that was supposed to demonstrate why the Stanley Parable is a quality experience worth your time and money. It was here somewhere, I'm sure of it. Oh, no, 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 no. We have to get out of here. We have to find something for you to do, anything. The demo cannot end like this. Now, ah, hurry, hurry, this way. I'm going. Okay, yes. This is new. This is different. Surely there must be a game somewhere in here. Okay, okay. Oh, how about this cup? Yes, go pick up the cup. <laughs> All right, now put it, um, um, in the bin. In the bin? Oh. I am um, trying to do something different, but apparently... You did it! You won! You know what you get for winning? An uh, achievement. The Parable game wow. that I've the Stanley was, Parable uh, just keeps choice. getting better and better. In fact, let me take a little survey of your experience. Based on what you've played so far, would you purchase the Stanley Parable? You responded. What a clear and straightforward demonstration of the merits of the Stanley Parable. I am convinced of the quality of the full game. Incredible. You <laughs> really do get it. You understand. Oh, I was so worried. <laughs> I just wanted you to know what I see in the Stanley Parable. What I think makes it, well, special. It's so very difficult to put into words. <sighs> oh, we're all beyond that now, aren't Where we? Where is that cup? <laughs> Come along. Let's get to the end and the final choice. All right. Ending, ending. Where are you? Where are you? I did not have much of a choice. I would like to point that out. Is this it? Uh... Yes, the end. Now, this is where we want the demo to be over. And I think it's time for you to log your final decision as to whether or not the Stanley Parable is any good. And it all comes to this. Please consider very carefully before answering. Much is at stake. Hmm. Well, to be quite honest, I'm going to choose no, because uh, I remember the first Stanley Parable ga game was full of choices. This one did not have any, so no. But I cannot Is choose no. I, are you sure? You sure yeah. you pressed the button? Bu what? No, we, we finished the demo. Did it start again? Hello? Is anyone there? They already finished. They said they liked it. I need someone to stop the demo. Hello? We need to go back. We need to get out of here. Why? And where? Oh, I expect Gabe Newell to come and kick my ass for saying no. Oh no, what's going on? Where is everyone? Okay, over to the left, down this way. All right, all right. Oh, nice and quiet. Yes. Finally. Well, I suppose we can both agree that I failed, haven't I? My job was to be a teacher, and I so badly wanted to teach you exactly what the Stanley Parable is supposed to be, but, but somehow I couldn't. I, uh, well, at any rate, I don't know if I care for the Stanley Parable anymore. Do you think any of this is actually in the main game? Honestly, I doubt it. What would that even look like? No, I think I've had enough of it. <laughs> no more doors, no more demonstrations, no more endings. What? That's the other problem with this game, there's too many bloody endings. I'm sick of them. How can one game end so many times? It doesn't make sense. But that's, that was oh, the beautiful the thing about Stanley Parable. No, so many endings. No, Never that's cool. Where Keep that. Going. Keep that no in the game. Just a blank slate. Yes, that's what I want. A game of beginnings. Hey. <laughs> Do you remember, just a few minutes ago, when we met for the first time, 
and I showed you the technology used to make the demo, because I thought there actually was a demo. <laughs> oh, we were so naive back then, how little we knew of the world. And then, when we ended up back in the waiting room, even though you'd already done that before, yes, it's uh -huh. all so fresh in my memory. They were such wonderful moments. Oh, and then when we played the game with the cup and you won, and then we kept wandering and we ended up in a stairwell somewhere, and we just kept right. climbing and climbing, flight after flight after flight. I thought they would never end. That did and not happen. we were on some kind of catwalk. I didn't have any idea what was down there. Did you? Wait. And we just kept going and we found that elevator and it said escape on it. Is this the full game? For a while, What's going to be the full game? We possibly know whether this was really an escape, but, but it seemed worth a try. And at the very least, it would be an adventure. So we got inside and we rode the elevator up and up and up. We had some sense that the end was coming, but we couldn't possibly know when. And then after so long, it finally stopped and we stepped out into the lush outdoors. The trees, the wildlife, the sun rising on a new and glorious I want to see it. Freedom. I want we to see free. those trees. There was Please. nothing to think. Please. Nothing Please. to know. Let me go. Simply us being right there in that moment. Wasn't it so beautiful? Wasn't that moment so singularly, piercingly beautiful? We were free. Oh, oh. This looks very familiar. Is that it? Is that the demo? Well, that was enjoyable. Really enjoyable. I guess uh, so many things will be carried over from the first game, and I am very happy for that. But the demo is very confusing to, I think, anyone who has played the Stanley Parable game that was released two or three years ago. But, anyways, very interesting demo. Very interesting. Thank, thank you all for watching. If you like my video, feel free to uh, like it and leave me some feedback. Uh, do you like anything about the way that I commentate over video games or leave me some advice. So, see you next time.